Bowman here at VW1.com. I'm going to give you the next part of how to hack your Verizon HTC Touch Pro 2. And in this hack, we're going to install a custom ROM. The custom ROM I'm going to be using here is Mighty ROM from Mighty Mike. So be sure to head over to MightyROM.com to check out their website. They have all great tips, tricks, and tutorials on how to hack your HTC Touch Pro 2. So go check that over there at MightyROM.com. So I've already downloaded Mighty ROM here. And the first thing you want to do before anything else is obviously back up all your information. So check out my uh, video on pin back up and also check out my video how to drag and drop files between your Windows PC and your Windows mobile phone to make sure you have all your stuff backed up so check that out also if you need pin back up check out one of the Bowman packs it's in all three versions of the Bowman pack and download it and in install on um, pin back up and back up your information before you do anything else so once you've done that the next thing you want to do is obviously download Mighty ROM from MightyROM.com I've downloaded the latest one here and you just have to click double click on it you want to click run here and it's going to ask to enter a password it's just MightyROM.com And now it's opened up, and it's just very similar to um, other ROM update utilities. It's pretty much kind of the same thing. You have to click the checkbox here. Click Next. You want to make sure you completed these steps above. You click Next. I'm going to verify the information. It's going to tell you what interviews you currently have and what you want to update to. Just click on Update from Mighty ROM to Mighty ROM. And we click Next. Click Next again, and the ROM update process will begin. Okay, now the ROM update is complete. You get this message here. Your Touch Pro 2 is, um, is finished being flashed. It's going to kind of go through the update process there as it's putting in the new ROM. So we're going to let it do that. And then I'm going to show you a few other things you need to do to make sure your HTC Touch Pro 2 is hacked properly. Okay, now that we have the custom ROM installed, we actually need to do a couple more things to make sure this ROM is installed pr properly on here. The next thing we need to do is we actually need to clear the storage out. The reason you want to do that is because sometimes some old stuff from the um, previous ROM that was installed could creep inside of here and could cause some weird things to go on. So we need to do that first. So we need to go to Start, we need to go to Settings, we need to go to System, and then we need to go to Clear Storage, and you need to press 1, 2, 3, 4, Click yes, and it'll begin to clear storage. It basically kind of just wipes it out again, but just make sure you have a clean install and there's nothing old from the um, original uh, ROM. Okay, now that we've cleared out the storage and we've assured that we have a clean ROM and a clean device, now the next thing we need to do is we need to actually do what's called carry provisioning. What you want to do in the Mighty ROM is you want to go to Start, you want to go to System, and you want to tap on Carrier Provisioning or Carrier Provision. Once that comes up, you want to choose the specific carrier that you have. From here, you, I see TELUS, Verizon, Sprint, US Cellular, other, and generic. For the Verizon, obviously, for the Touch Pro 2 for Verizon, you want to hit on Verizon. So we'll just tap on them. And we'll click at the bottom where it says Commit. And it's going to begin installing the cab. The cab provisioning brings the custom, the customization specifics to that particular Touch Pro 2 and that particular network. Obviously, this is the Verizon Touch Pro 2, so we want that specifics on here. Okay, we're just going to do a quick reboot on that, and we'll come back. We've got a couple more things we got to set. Okay, once your device has come back up from that reboot, you need to install two more cabs. You can find these cab files at MightyROM.com or in the PPC Geeks thread for, for the Mighty ROM itself. So, the first thing we're going to install here, is specifically for Verizon, is the JoJo B Arcsoft MMS. This will allow you to send SMS and MMS messages on your custom ROM HTC Touch Pro 2.
Okay, once that's installed, next thing you want to install is right over here. This is the Myron Verizon keyboard layout. This gives the customization keyboard layout for the Verizon version of the Touch Pro 2. Once that's installed, you're all set to go. So those last two files are specifically for the Verizon um, HTC Touch Pro 2 with this Mighty ROM cab. So you want to grab those at uh, MightyROM.com or PPCGeeks.com. You can check out the Mighty ROM thread there. So that's pretty much it. This is how you do the custom custom ROM installation for your HTC Touch Pro 2. I'm going to do a little video a little bit later on showing you some of the customization of the Mighty ROM. It's pretty it's pretty cool ROM here. So I'm going to show you that a little bit probably in the next video. So this is Bowman from BW1.com. Reminding you to follow us on Twitter at Twitter.com slash BW1.com. Subscribe to our YouTube page. Click this yellow button subscribe link right on the side of this video. Check us on the stream. We have that set up and going. Follow the RSS feed on the site. And always remember to live your tech world in high definition.